Yo, it's your boy Adel. Going to be showing the bronze pack method and how you can grind an insane amount of packs. All it requires is a bit of coins and a lot of your time. So, before we get started, we've got our Elite Two Foot Chance League rewards. We've got our Div One Rivals rewards. We're going to be opening on the stream. Come and join us. The link is in the description below. If you want my Elite Two Custom Tactics video, like this video, subscribe to our channel, and I will get that done for you for Friday. So, let's run you through all of the steps for the bronze pack method. So, if you don't know what it is, Essentially, you need a bit of coins. Some people might do 100k, 50k, kind of depends how much coins and times you've got on your hand. The more you do, the more packs you get at the end of it. What we're going to do is show you this. So you're going to go to bronze packs, you're going to buy the cheapest one for 400 coins. That's all it is. And then skip it. And obviously you've got to rinse and repeat this, but I'll show you exactly how the bronze pack method works and how obviously people do packs from it. Literally, if you haven't got that much coins, but you've got a bit of time on your hands, you can keep doing this and eventually you can do an icon SVC out of it. That's all how it will work. So when you open your pack, if you want to be lazy, you can send everything to your club, into your club. If you've got a little bit of times in your hand, then you can quick sell these sort of irrelevant ones and get a little bit of coins for it. It does add up. And if you've got any players from the top five leagues or top five nationalities, so like English, French, Spanish, Premier League, La Liga, French League, etc., then check what their value is. If they're worth anything like this guy's worth 700 coins for a bronze card, that's pretty decent because it's top five leagues and top five nations, Spanish and Espanol, obviously uh, they're the top league in there. So I'll just sell this guy quickly, but not everyone, you don't have to do this, but if you wanna make it a little bit more coins, then you can do this. So quickly sell that one. And then the other ones, which are just normal players, send them to your club. And that's all you wanna do. So you probably made like, you probably made profit from that one essentially anyway, but I'll, I'll show you a couple more times and then you'll get the idea of it. If you obviously don't have anyone that's top five leagues or top five nationalities, just send them to your club because you're gonna need them for the next thing. So let's have a look if there's anyone here. We only actually got two players. I'm just gonna literally quick sell all of these ones here because I'm not gonna require them and I've got a bit of time on my hands. So 40 coins and two players to go in our club. So for example, you might do that. You might pump like 50K into that if you've got time, yeah? Obviously it, it takes a while. You can do 20K, it's completely up to you. So once you've done those and you've got a load of bronze players in your club, so that's the whole point of it. You're trying to get bronze players in your clubs. Obviously, if you're gonna have ones from the top five leagues and nationalities, you make a little bit of coins here and there. What you're gonna do is go to the bronze upgrade pack. So here we've got it here. I'm just gonna do squad builder because that will save us a lot of time. So squad builder, do bronze, build the squad. Hopefully we've got enough players here. I don't even know who, who is in our club. And yeah, we do. And some players like this might actually be worth a lot if he is tradable because he's French, but he's in the MLS, so he's not. It's usually top five nationalities and leagues. So do, do watch out for them because you might have a couple in the club which are worth more than, than you actually think. But yeah, they, I'm happy to get rid of all of those. Submit that. Remember, once you've done loads of bronze packs, then you'll be doing loads of bronze upgrades and eventually you will have a ton of these silver pack so it's two silver players packs that you receive from it the kind of issue with doing this method this year compared to last year is they're making everything untradeable which is annoying they're trying to take the coins out of our club but yeah hopefully you would have done loads of those bronze upgrades and then you have loads of these packs that will come out of it obviously it's untradeable so let's just go ahead and skip that and we should receive two silver players here which obviously you can't sell so that's it let's imagine we've got loads of those let's say we've got 100 silver players from that then what do you do after that ado you go to sbc again you just skip this just press l1 go to upgrade and then you perform the silver upgrade so let's go ahead and do this one as well i just show you it step by step so you know exactly what i am talking about and doing it just requires exactly uh silver rated players 11 of them so we just put silver and build squad hopefully again we've got enough players in our club which i think we've got a load of yes we do so let's just submit those as well Get rid of them. Most of them are most likely untradeable anyway. And then submit that. And then at the end of it, what do you receive from it? You receive, I believe it is three common gold players, if I'm correct, there you go. Three common gold players from it. So do loads of those silver upgrades and then you'll be getting a ton of gold players from it. So if you complete two, that's six players, complete four, and that's 12 gold players. Obviously they're, they're not gonna be high rated and they're not rare. But that's perfectly fine. So if you pump like 50k into those, you will have so many gold players coming back from that. And also maybe you can save some of the silver ones as well. And then what you do, once you've got all of those gold players in your club, what you can do is something like this, the rare player pick. So what are the requirements for this? It is literally, you don't even need rares. You just need seven gold players. And then you can have four silvers if you like, or, or do 11 gold, but that's kind of pointless. 
There is obviously other ones as well. That was just an example. I was doing a load of those player picks yesterday, but that's kind of how it works. There is also the gold upgrade where you get two rare gold players uh, from it. So you got to put 11 non-rare golds in there. But yeah, that one, I don't really think it's that worth it. I'd personally do the other one, to be honest with you. Um, if there is any any decent ones on the SBCs like that, which aren't always there, then they're usually worth it. This rare, this rare player pick. The UCL one is good as well, but you need rare golds for that. So if you did want to put them in the other gold upgrade, get the rares and then do it from this. But yeah, you will need a hell of a lot more to do that one. It's just worth doing this one anyway. And obviously, if there's any, any other new SBCs that will fit, but that's literally how the bronze pack method works. It's really simple. Rinse and repeat. It takes a lot of time. Maybe you're just chilling on the side. You ain't got much to do and you can just keep doing it. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Smash that thumbs up. If you want the custom that this video tomorrow, subscribe to our channel. See you on stream for our foot chance rewards. Hopefully we pack something good. Let me know what you pack as well down below in the comments. It's been your boy. At least one more thing to say. Safe.